603, now we're going to shift gears a bit. Traveling can be difficult, especially when harsh winter conditions come early. MTN's John Amy talked to a man traveling by bus back to his home in Seattle who ended up getting stranded in Butte in the cold with nowhere to stay. Getting stuck in Butte on a cold morning after his connection at the bus depot failed to arrive, Jeremiah Smith found a way to keep warm. Just keep him walking, hood up, shivering. Smith took a bus from Idaho Falls and arrived in Butte after midnight Tuesday on a Salt Lake City Express bus and learned the next bus to take him back home to Seattle would not arrive until the next morning. He and four other travelers were told the depot would be locked in the morning and he couldn't wait inside. Frigid. I think it was 14 degrees when we got in. Um, so, you know, you can see this is what I have to wear. I talked to a representative from Salt Lake Express who said they only provided him a ticket to Butte and he would have to make arrangements with another carrier. Smith said he's surprised there's no shelter at the depot to wait for his other bus. When you're in a cold area, you know, I mean, you have to expect for people to be in emergency situations. Jeremiah says he's not too concerned with himself because he's fit and he can tolerate this cold, but he's worried other people who are more vulnerable might get into the same situation. And, you know, that's my underlying concern. Like, I, you know, I'm going to get through this, but going forward, there's a lot of people, a lot of families that use this service. In Butte, John Amy, MTN News.